Good morning world and welcome to Tuesday 18th of April. They're hiding. Tweedledee, Tweedledum and Tweedle the other one. Oh. Let's we're take that. We're going to dig, we? we're gonna play with dig. If you could take the high side, yeah I got the track fixed yesterday, what a bloody job that was. If you take the high sides off my Defender and then reverse them up to the top and put the trailer on it there, yeah. by which time I'll have finished feeding the cattle. We'll fuel up the digger. Go. Okay. Probably doing the tree. Doing the tree. The tree. Yeah. Did you do Julian turn up today? Or? Sorry? Julian going to turn up today? Or? I will ring him in a minute and find out. I'll take the other way from the outside coming from him. Yeah, leave it out for him. Yeah. Okay. All right, no worries. Okay. <laughs> We've still got a bit in there, but I think we'll get another bale anyway, just in case. Right, so now we're going to take the high sides off my Land Rover. We'll put the uh, digger transport trailer on, and then we're off only about a mile, probably not even a mile, that way. And the job for the tree company this morning is to transplant an oak tree. It's about 15 foot tall and the tree's been in there for quite a few years and this is dead risky moving it now because the tree's coming in, trees come into the bud and the two times you don't mess about with trees is when they're coming into leaf when and when they're dropping leaf. So we've told the client this is very risky but um, the client has told us there's no choice, we have to move the tree. Um, ASAP. We've got somewhere to put it. Uh, so I will speak to the client before I tell you any more of the story, because it's kind of their story. If they're happy for me to share it, with or without names, I will. And if not, then I'll just do snippets of us trying to move the tree with as little damage to the roots as possible. There's a real big reason, apart from the health of the tree, why we can't damage the roots. Mainly because there's somebody underneath it. Mm, that's what you think, isn't it? So we're going to give the cattle another bale rather than move them into another field. There's a reason for that. Um, I need to get them back in sort out uh, what's staying here at the farm and can go out and play with the ball and what's got to go over the farm so they're out in the field which has given them some space but they've kind of eaten that out there there's very little food left um, so I need to give them some meat and I need to give them a reason to come back in the yard That's piqued their interest. Oh, what a noise. Come on, back it up. Back it up. Stay.
Right, this is the dodgy bit because I've got the reds in there. So I've got to scare them out. get a chance to sort these out this afternoon. Maybe. Right, everything is end is okay. Food, so that's kind of it for a minute. Right. Get a trail on. to suss it out. They've never put this trail on before. Got it sussed? Yeah, you find, now, you find the right key? Yeah. There's two keys. Yeah, we've done it. So, one key has got a little X mark etched on it. Mm -hmm. Well, the... you used to put that word. <laughs> <laughs> the first it didn't work, so you yeah. the second key. Yeah, so one key's got a little X mark, so that's the key for the cattle trailer. Mm -hmm. And the key with it, a little X mark on it, is, yes. is that one. Okay, well, well done. You've managed to suss it out. Okay. Yeah, well, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> right. Oh, you put some fuel in that thing. So, uh, by the barrow down there and the yeah. cement, there's two buckets, a four foot and a. Um, what? Coffee, coffee. Okay. You haven't locked up, have you? Yeah, I haven't got. I haven't got. Yeah, okay, I'll lock up. And then grab a smaller one. You want what, sorry? There's two buckets down yeah. by the cement and the barrow. Yeah. So what the smaller one. The yeah. Up. And I'll fuel that thing up. Uh it might be an idea to put some air in that tire. Yeah, well, I've got one. Yeah. God. I'd put air in there first. How can I get this part? Yeah. All right, um, I need to go that way. Just chuck it on the floor right there, that'd be all right. And then uh, put some air in that tire yeah. for for you completely. Um, um, what's the name it? Eh? Hey? Uh, all I can hear is an echo. 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 The barra? <laughs> yeah, that's a good idea. Put the tire up, fill it out with logs, and take it back up there again. <laughs> eh? Hey? That's a very good idea. Well, um, Julian's on his way. He's about 25 minutes away, so we'll get all loaded up, we'll wait for him, then he can go, then we can go. Right. So I've told the clerk we probably won't. Are you actually being serious about logs? Yeah. Fuck it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, what, you, have you got something better to do? <laughs> yeah, that's a no then. <laughs> I'd, I'd, I'd pull that forward a bit, mate, pull the chipper forward a bit, in the way. If you, um, Ewan, if you go over by where the little bird pen was, yeah. there's a log next to it. There's two bars next to the log. You want to bring them over? Because yeah. I used them to put the track on yesterday and then forgot to bring them back. So. 
two big steel bars. Yeah. Start on that one up the side if you want, uh, Mikey. No, the one on the floor over here. If you come around the picker, go the other side. We'll make a start on that one. Eh? Hey? Yeah. Well, I'll tell, you, I'll tell you, actually, hang on a second. How dry are they? Are they dry or are they the damper one? Because I don't want to, there's a point taking damp up there. They don't look that bad. Oh, that'd be all right. Yeah. Yeah, that'd be. So, have a look at the weight of it. Oh, that's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's okay, yeah. That's the left handed um, moisture meter, that is. And we'll stop around about there. Right, Here. you find them, you put them on the track to do? Yeah. Yeah, so we'll, we'll have them, then we've got them, won't yeah. we, so. Okay, so we'll take that one as well. Um, it's only a little bit smaller than this one. It's got better teeth. And if I've got to dig about in rubble, um, yeah, it might be a bit more useful. Park yourself. I always hated it when he said that to me. I said you can leave it there. I don't expect you to fill the log basket as well. Tell the lads have been here because stuff's never quite how I left it. Just check. I didn't put the trailer on, so not that I'd trust him, but better safe than arrested. on there. 